Hello, and welcome to Enterprise Rent-A-Car. I'd like to rent a car, please. Do you have any chargers? I'm sorry, but all of our chargers have been rented. Do you have a reservation? No, but your website said that you have chargers. Well, we do carry them. We just don't have any available right now. Would you like to try an Impala instead? I cannot be seen in an Impala. Can I have a free upgrade? I'm sorry, but without having had a reservation, I can't offer a free upgrade. Well, how much more is the Explorer? Typically, the SUV is $100 per day, but since we did not have your first choice, I can offer it to you for $75 per day. I can't afford that. Can I do the $9.99 weekend special? That only applies to our economy car, the Avia. Would you like to try the Avia? No, I would like to do the $9.99 special for the Explorer. I'm sorry, but we cannot give you that price. That is only for our economy cars. Can I have the pickup truck for $9.99? No, the pickup truck is also normally $100 per day. Why are they so expensive? I can't afford to pay more than $9.99. Well, they are usually in high demand, given that you are in Minnesota and the four-wheel drive comes in handy in snowy weather. I don't care about four-wheel drive. I wanted a charger. Are you sure you don't have any chargers? Let me check. Yes. I'm sure and, if you can only afford $9.99 all I can offer you is the Avia. Fine, I will take it. What do you need from me? Just a driver's license and major credit card. Here is my license and my credit card. This is actually a debit card. Do you have a card that is not linked to your checking account? No, that is my only credit card. There's plenty of money on it. Call my bank. It doesn't matter. This card does not have a line of credit attached to it. Yes, it does. It says Visa right there. That's because Visa is the company that your bank pays to handle its electronic transactions. There is no line of credit on this card. We can still rent you the car, but we require more information. What information? We require proof of insurance and a copy of your utility bill. Why? Because we want to make sure that if you crash our car, that we will be reimbursed. I'm not going to crash, so can we skip that? No, unfortunately this is mandatory without a credit card. Can I buy your insurance? If you do not have insurance of your own, you will be required to purchase our full insurance. How much does that cost? It is $32 a day. That's more than I am paying for the car. Do you have any cheaper insurance? No, unfortunately we do not. Darn. Well, I need the car, so I guess I have to take it. And do you have a current utility bill? I have my cell phone bill. Does that count? Yes, let me see. It says you have an outstanding balance of $432.17. I paid it this morning. It is all paid. We are not allowed to rent a car to you unless you have a utility bill that does not show an outstanding balance. Can't you call my cell phone company? I promise that it is paid. Fine, I believe you. The total comes to 14367. We will have to make a sale on your card for 243. Wait, why? Isn't the car supposed to be 999? Yes, but after 3 days with the full insurance and taxes, it comes to 14367. That is a lot of money. For that amount, I should get a charger. Can I switch into a charger tomorrow? If one returns, I can call you, but the charger is not an economy car and would be more expensive. I can't afford any more. I'll just take the economy car. Okay. I'm sorry. It looks like your card declined the sale. Are you sure you do not have another card? No, that's impossible. There are thousands of dollars on that card. Well, it declined the sale for 243, so the balance in your account must be less than that. It must be a computer glitch. Can I pay when I get back? No, I can't rent you the car without a deposit. You're not providing very good customer service. I'm going to write a letter to Jack Taylor. He plays golf with my dad. Your dad does not know Jack Taylor, and he does not even run the company anymore, and I'm not going to let you drive out of here in an $18,000 vehicle with no line of credit, no deposit, no insurance, and a utility bill that is past due. If you don't rent me the car, I'm going to go to Hertz, and I swear to God I will never come back to Enterprise. Then walk your broke ass down the street to Hertz and see if you can find someone as retarded as you. My God, I can't count with both hands how many ways you do not qualify to rent a car. Frankly, I'm shocked that you are even smart enough to get your driver's license to begin with. How many times did you fail the written portion of the exam before you happened upon the right combination of answers you illiterate, worthless piece of shit? You're embarrassed to be seen in anything but a charger? You rode here on the bus and have less than $243 to your name. I'm sick and tired of bending over backwards 
to please you stupid fox that can't even comprehend the difference between a debit card and a credit card. My only comfort is going home at night and resting soundly knowing that you are out there somewhere falling for a pyramid scheme or asking for an iPhone with a bigger GBs. End your life as soon as you can and save yourself the embarrassment of having to live through more situations like this. Fine, I'll go, but can you call Hertz to see if they have any chargers?